Kevin and Cassius, IFL team in association with Matkins Gym, Marbella, we're in Hull here. Did you look at what I was looking up there? Yeah, yeah. I do that, I don't know. <laughs> Everyone does it, they look where I'm looking at. Yeah. <laughs> uh, here at the Hull Ice Arena with me, we've got Tom Knight, uh, 5 and 0 for you now. Just, yeah. Yeah, Gary Cooper, he was strong in there. Yeah, it was, it really, his shots were strong, he only threw really um, simple hooks but and he died towards the end. But I felt a little bit uh, rusty because I've had, I've had, say, seven months out. First two rounds took me a bit to get into it but I, I, I slowly um, found myself in, in round uh, three, four, five and six. So I enjoyed that, it was good. Obviously he's coming off the, the back of a a yeah. little bit of a surprise win over Sonny Upton yeah. uh, recently, so he was well, coming in in yeah. good spirit sort of thing. Good yeah, form. I mean, I've seen it, and I, I, obviously I didn't think it was a it was a very fair stoppage, but that's for some that's for the referee to decide. Um, so, but it'll be never, never, nevertheless he, he beat him by stoppage, so he will be he will be very um, confident coming from that. Um, I watched a few of his videos before, and like I said on the other interview, I've seen he was quite strong. But to be honest, he was a lot more stronger than I expected. So, uh, yeah, he was, was a good lad. He was good. I'm Absolutely. happy with the win, yeah. Absolutely. But you've, you've banked them six rounds now, yeah. so. Uh, are you out again before the end of the year? Um, I don't know yet. We'll see what happens. I'd, like, I'd maybe like to see if I can get on this next Cogo show. I'm selling tickets in two weeks. Might not be um, okay, but we'll see. Um, I want to be out more often, like I said, I've had seven months out, so I could do a few in quick succession now. Fights like that with tough guys. Obviously, I want to be knocking people out because you've got to get people know, know who you are, but people like that, they're not in there to be knocked out. They're in there to give you the rounds or to beat you if they can. So, um, I just want to do the best I can, keep on learning every single fight. Absolutely. Uh, are you pleased with the way everything's gone since you've turned pro? Yeah. Now I well, it's, well, it's getting it's getting yeah. there. I'm happy now with Dave. And don't get me wrong, my old manager Stevie Smith, I'm very good friends with him. And it, and it wasn't because he's, he's a bad bad manager or anything. I, I was the only manager, he, I mean, boxer he managed me and uh, Fergus Taylor. Um, and he ended up giving that up. So now I'm with uh, a good a good manager and promoter. I reckon um, the fight's going to keep coming. Good. So 2015, you're really going to yeah. push on now, Tom. Yeah, definitely. I'd like another t another few titles. I want I want the British Masters bronze in my last fight. Um, I think I'm ready for that. Slowly. I don't want to rush myself, but then again, I don't want to be um, going in against these. You have to fight the Jamie, but I, don't, I want to be learning the, the tough fights like that. That's what I want to prove to myself how good I am before I can prove to everybody else how good I am. Right, that's a fair assessment. All right, well, listen, Tom. Thanks for giving us a little bit of time, and congratulations. If we see you fight before the end of the year, we yeah. do. If not, then on to 2015 for you. Yeah, of course. Hopefully, a big 2015. Right, do you want to shout any sponsors out? Uh, yeah, definitely. I've got the flooring. Sean Scott is the manager there. Accounting Solutions, um, a real catch, and Monster Supplements from Hull. Yeah, thanks, guys. All right. Cheers, okay. Paul. Coogan Kessis, Tom Knight, IFL TV. Thank you very much.